Dang, Scorpio, it just cut right on. I'm gonna do y'all reading for 15 minutes. I'm gonna pull it from this oracle deck, pop from here, read it, and then we'll get into the tarot. No time to waste. If you're feeling the vibe, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you to all of my new subscribers. Y'all fell out the eighth house and Pluto. I'll be seeing y'all fell out like an astronaut. Y'all see up my astronaut. <laughs> y'all fell out. Y'all fell out the eighth house. We all gonna have a kiss just like Gemini. I think I might be kissing a Gemini, honey. Y'all might need him at church or something. Somebody said the fault line. Oh, damn, sure so I'm about to be me, nobody at church. I know that's right, you never know. I ain't saying that for nothing. Fault line. Do the fault line. You either do it that situation, resurrect, get to the heart of, do it that situation. Major changes, life or death issues, or oh boy, somebody done overset the boundary. 49, you know, 13, that's a 4. Six, seven, eight, eight, nineteen, eleven, twelve. That's three. It's linked to eternity. <laughs> oh, I found it. Then lost it. Oh, my sixty-one. Y'all about to be enlightened about something. The Fisher. The crack, the weak link. Imagine walking across a frozen lake that begins to crack before your eyes. No matter how optimistic and brave you might be, panic ensues. You become fearful, intense, and long for a stable ground. Such is the energy of the fault line. It's the energy of walking on eggshells of precarious dynamics, of sensing, of sensing what is ready to break open into chaos. It's likely this cracking open is overdue. As fault lines develop slowly and naturally from underlying elemental pressures, this card comes as a potent warning not to deny the shakiness that's afoot. It's much better to prepare yourself for change, major change, to walk along the fault line pretending all is well, than to walk along the fault line pretending all is well. There is no easy fix for the situation at hand. It will require a foundational shift that alters the current dynamics from the ground up. Mm, Y'all about to be rebuilding. In Japanese Kintsugi pottery, gold is used to mend cracks. That's what I got right here. Breaks are, th are thought of as precious rather than something to be hidden. This is Kintsukuro. To repair with gold, restore pottery is considered more beautiful have for having been broken. So some of y'all are more beautiful because of the trials y'all came through. <clears throat> people may be ready to beat people ass about you. Motherfuckers we'll across the line. It's be a do or die situation. You are the weakest link. It is possible that sometimes a loved one said caused a something a loved one said caused a crack in your relationship that has never been mended. Revisit it. The time to heal is not. And y'all be yeah. Making amends with people. When light, redefining. Reality breaking open when dark, precariousness, pretending, and delusion. Go deeper, dance to everything is broken by Bob Dylan. Hmm. So many shifts. Mm hmm. Somebody broke your heart or something happened. The lines crossed. Page of Cups. Yeah, some of y'all are like a child because y'all have been through so much. Some people are real overprotective with some of y'all. Not that y'all can't defend y'all selves. This is y'all been having an uphill battle for a minute. Maybe. Leave him alone. Leave her alone. Enough already. Pluto. Where you at me, baby? Oh, what's in Capricorn? Goes direct October 8th. Hmm. 
Hmm. Capricorn is significant. It's significant. It was Aquarius reading by default. I forgot to change it out, but Pluto is definitely an important planet. Especially ruling do or die. Resurrection to get to the heart of some shit. You must. You don't have no options. You gotta go that way. And sometimes it's for the better. Two of Cups. Mm-hmm. Reciprocal relationships. Yep. Instead of people always breaking your heart. You gotta act like it ain't happening. Hey, how you doing, Yeah, Eight of Pentacles. Some of y'all just say y'all Y'all strong, but kind of been strong for too long, kind of shit. Lost some people along the way. You're going to read me and some stuff. But some stuff ain't going to be, it ain't going to be minimal, but you're going to be better because of it. You're going to get the wisdom. Extract the wisdom out of it. And put some gold in them cracks, you know. Mm -hmm. Five of Pentacles. Feeling left out in the cold by people. You here for everybody, but when it's time for somebody to be here for you, which way did he go? Which way did he go? And then when you be the one to do the most, they talk about what you hadn't done. You know, you're like, what the fuck else could I? I mean, damn, I was only working with what I had. You know what I'm saying? What the fuck? Yeah, man. <laughs> y'all strong. Y'all talking about a lot of bullshit, conflict, destruction, all this motherfucking time. People just breaking your heart. Y'all fuck around and release a whole bunch of motherfuckers. Mm-hmm. So my final decision. People having awakenings, becoming aware. The shit that they've been dealing with. And a lot of people getting it through high priestess energy. It's terrible. Some of y'all are highly intuitive. There's some things that's hidden. That's so all it's going to come to light. Or it already has. Pluto was in retrograde. Ten eight, it goes to that. Mm-hmm. Breaking free. You motherfuckers the same as a fool car. I mean, you falling back and coming and going. Yeah. Being hip to shit. Mm-hmm. Being observant, being watchful. Some of y'all, um, energy, or not energy, but some of y'all intuition has been heightened. Mm-hmm. <laughs> y'all transmuting, digging up some roots. This one has come up before. Mm-hmm. Yeah, instead of hardest and shit. Oh wait. Y'all make my arm heavy. Y'all just hit hard. <laughs> For real. I got a, a Libra season coming up. This is all justice kind of I gotta burn this. For my subscribers and for myself and then I'm gonna resell it as a recyclable. It's a vibe. Especially if you always facing some damn court and shit like that. If you're in business, those type of candles work. You ain't have to always you get your lawyer a break. You know? <laughs> you got your ancestors to say some shit. Well, ain't nobody ever got the time. Lawyers be like, damn. You pay me enough. What do you get my to this shit? I got other clients. You know, you can get some help from someone else. Put their pure legal on the phone. Candle acts as a paralegal. Yeah. Pretty sure they got enough clientele. Having a drink like a motherfucker. That's attorneys. I'm coming. Who coming? You want somebody coming to make a man? Somebody either powerful or powerless. If they messy, they definitely gonna hit that fault line. <laughs> They're gonna get the scorpion sting because all of them are soft and away. I ain't never got the time. Unexpected text. Y'all gonna be deleting people. Coming in. Mm hmm. And coming into more opportunities because you delete motherfuckers. If you're under the age of 25, start praying more. Mm hmm. Some of y'all gonna come in the union with somebody. Y'all tired or not winning in the love department. Or it's just always up and down, distractions, bullshit, people ain't got business trying to rip it apart. Just ooh, messy. Messy. 
sexual attachments, yeah. Mm-hmm. The unexpected text is going to be sexual attachments. Uh, you're going to be about to turn a profit. Come into some opportunities. You're going to get rid of that, that shit. You're trying to build something with someone that you feel happy and safe with. And they ain't going to take you up and down in your emotions. The five of swords. I mean the five of, uh, excuse me, wands. Distractions. Like, go the fuck here. I don't know. Silly rabbits. Let's come up in reverse. Huh. <laughs> some divine some divine feminine y'all gonna get uh, distorted that's what they say she ain't gonna wise energy that feel like you know they, they don't they feel a certain way but you don't feel the same way about them you know they ain't shit but a sexual attachment y'all done with that y'all want something real y'all gonna get something real too two of cups is the first thing for y'all not only intimacy but different Try, try, try. Mm hmm Let's talk about I know. I bet. I bet. If you strategic. you got that kind of intuition, y'all come up with the uh, high priestess and the magician. You know what the fuck you want to <laughs> Yeah, man. When you understand value, you ain't going to be able to look big. I ain't going that way. You know what I'm saying? You can watch me. You can watch me be successful, but I got to set hard-ass boundaries, you know what I'm saying? For my own self-respect, you know what I'm saying? Also, for your shit, like, no. You be so proud of yourself, feeling just like that. For real. When you set boundaries, well, you usually would have let motherfucker get that off and don't say shit. Man, when you set a boundary, you be feeling so powerful. You're so proud of yourself, like, oh, yeah, man. You don't have to keep on with that shit. And just to prove to yourself you wasn't tripping. Why would it here? Especially when y'all see money start coming in. When y'all start deleting people, whether you masking or feminine, it doesn't matter. It's going to be a do or die situation. Clearly it is. Y'all phone going to get to ring on with opportunities. Whatever that is. Whether y'all apply for a loan, a job, it doesn't matter. You gonna turn a profit where you gonna see opportunities all in those motherfuckers sitting here blocking it. Y'all angelic host is like <laughs> back up, hang in. Back up, you gonna be the hang man. Yeah, I fuck around trying to get y'all a nervous breakdown or D at some of these people. Or some of them have just got attachment issues. Thinking sex gonna fix everything, a threesome, or a celebration, let's have a dream. No. You need intensive therapy. Mm hmm. Some of the men are gonna be strong in their bullshit. Give me urge energies. King of Saps in reverse. Crazy as a motherfucker. Mm hmm. They go to women. <laughs> Devil made them do it. I bet. Y'all unbothered cutting their ass off. Two of swords. Sitting on a block of cement. Talk about them. no. Mm hmm. Working on y'all wealth and the provision piece. And if some of y'all coming into some. Money, yeah. Some of y'all neglected y'all self. Now the cups in reverse. Y'all coming into with somebody just safe, like I said on the last meeting. Definitely ain't got the time. Especially when I'm crazy. I'm just looking for a good time. Reverse. Uh-uh. I got a whole lot on the line. I ain't got time to be playing with your ass. I'm like, what the fuck? There's going to be some of y'all children. <laughs> People gonna be trying to play pop up or just people y'all used to work with. Y'all gonna redo some shit. Y'all gonna restructure y'all life. Mm-hmm. People that's crazy over money looking crazy. It's crazy. Like, what is wrong with you? Let me pop a couple from here, y'all. This is about to go off. Definitely a do or die situation. Definitely about to come into some intimacy and the friendships. Forgiveness. Yeah, make amends with some people. And they're going to be on your level. Just misunderstandings. Because, see, biblical. Some people at church. Some of y'all going to meet somebody at church. I'm telling you. Trust. Have faith. Some of y'all are fathers. Uh huh. Y'all got to be done with it. Do or die. Y'all got children to raise. Y'all like, hell no. <laughs> no, ma'am. 